Well, that's not good. Better lock the doors here. All right. See, people are just dying to get in here at Yankee Dev Blair. Hey, my name is CJ, and welcome back to Yankee Dev. Of course, every day is a train show. Uh, Engineer Hall, are you excited to look at some new products? Sure, always excited to look at some new products here. That's right. So, uh, why don't we get away from this scene and and okay, this, yeah. No, no, don't don't give them attention. They're they're fine. You sure? No, we're just, we're just looking at trains. All right, so let's look at trains. I know, right? but look at them. Yeah. Okay. All right, let's look at some new cars. All right, you ready? Yeah, but right. hey, you know, but are you worried about that zombie thing outside? Cause it was definitely no, zombie that, out. That's fine. That's fine. We gotta look at trains. That's more important here. Okay. Okay. So uh, let's take a look at some Atherin. As a matter of fact, everything you see in today's show is gonna be the all Atherin show. So check this out here. We gotta start with the sixty foot all, uh, PS Auto Box Car. I said that right, engineer. Huh? Isn't that fun? That's cool. So I took one of these out of the box here. This is the Southern. Look at that super cushion service. So if you were to do something to it that's cushion right and then i have a couple other ones here these are the genesis so the box is opened up nice so let's see if we can not get a glare here uh we have here the western pacific that was the lnn the first one i have here the cotton belt and probably my favorite one here the rio grande i just love that design there now of course everyone always sees box cars and if you need a way to do transport your automobiles with automobiles going here Mm, not not modern, but you know, old school old stuff. Old school probably. stuff, right? So this would be the old way that you would do that. I love these extended couplers there. Look at the top there and the bottom. Oh, look at that, Engineer Hall. I really enjoy that. The detailing with the little silver on the top of the air hose. Isn't that neat? That's pretty cool, but you know what also look good? What? When it derails you all that bottom detail. Okay, well hopefully uh your railroad isn't derailing that much. Uh but these are really nice like a box cars here, and as engineer hall always says, you can never have enough box cars, right? That's right. All right, so the retail value of these cars is forty nine dollars and ninety nine cents, but we had them here for thirty nine dollars and ninety nine cents. I think it'll look great to put them all together and have a nice long box car train. So come to Yankee Dabba and get this Athen Genesis on your rails today. Hey. Hmm. Um, I think we got the zombie problem. I think I should, should check that out. Um, I'm not worried about <laughs> trains. That's more important. You sure? Mm -hmm. All right. So we got another new car here from Athens. It's actually another Athens Genesis car that we're going to be taking a look at here. And what's that? What's that? Uh, it's my phone doing some type of. Uh, what's a zom? Oh, it's cut off. Zom something alert. Zom. Zom, I don't know, whatever. I'm not worried about. Anyway, here. Is that so Zoom? Maybe Zoom. Snooze? Z Z a zoo animal? Possibly zoos. Mm -hmm. Anyway, we're talking about trains here today because we have here another hopper car for you to take a look at here. Let's check it out, shall we? So this is the 40 foot 2600 CF air slide hopper car here and what i have here is i have the d and h one that i took out and then just like the box cars again these come into nice atherin genesis box car uh boxes rather so i have here the open window here i have the pennsylvania railroad i have here the northern pacific i have here what is that one that is ooh, it's refined sugar do you like sugar engineer hall diabetes oh okay and then finally i have here the santa fe and i also have a lehigh valley one that i didn't take out of the box and we do have the lehigh valley if you're a lehigh valley fan yeah. but take a look at all the detail on this of course this is the atherin genesis series so this is a little bit more detailed than say the regular atherin cars here or the roundhouse cars but i really like the design there i mean just take a look at all the intricate piping and everything that's happening in there as well as what's happening on the bottom here. You gotta be careful with these cars, okay? You can't be too rough with them, but they're really nicely designed. I have multiple different road numbers for these cars here. So I don't know what you're waiting for, Engineer Hall. You definitely need these on your railroad right now. Now the retail value of these cars is $44.99. I'm sorry, $59.99, but we're selling them here at Yankee Dabbler for $44.99. So it's a great deal to get on these cars here. So I don't know what you guys are waiting for here. These are awesome looking hopper cars that were also looking at the box. Thanks, guys. Get some Athens Genesis on your railroad today because I know you're really going to enjoy it. Hey, Frank. How you doing? What? You're bitten by what? What? Okay, well, come on. We, we have orders to send out. You got to still come into work. I, I don't care how much blood is everywhere. What? So I put a band-aid on it. Yeah, put a band-aid on it. What? You feel funny. I, I Now you're just talking. He's going like... Rah. 
right, yeah, okay. Very funny, Frank. Get to work here. He needs some People milk. He's just trying to get out of work here. I mean, bitten by his neighbor. Ooh, whatever. <laughs> anyway, so today we're going to be taking a look at a three-pack of hopper cars here. We saw the Athens Genesis. Now for a more economical, friendly car we have here from the Roundhouse, also made by Athens. We got these hopper cars, so let's check out these puppies, shall we? So these are really cool-looking hopper cars here. I have here the three-pack at the Chesapeake in Ohio, as well as other ones that I have here. These are the four-pack of the, I'm sorry, the four bay open hopper cars. They're a three pack. And I love the design of these cars here, especially this one right here, the Peabody. I don't know. I mean, look, you can have a bunch of black and brown, but I like some color on my railroad there. Western Maryland looks cool too. And of course I have here the Missouri Pacific, but these are just really look, great looking cars here. I didn't take them out because after what they do is they seal them for quality assurance or freshness either or so i mean these are just really great looking cars here they're not as detailed as say the genesis cars here but they just look good you know if you're looking for you know more economical friendly car to put on your rails i think this is that fits the bill here um Athen does a great job with their products and the price for this is pretty good now the three pack retails for 101.99 but we're selling here at yankee dabbler for 79.99 and as i said you can make a nice long unit train with these hopper cars here you can mix them all up i think that will look great so come to yankee dabbler and get these atherin cars before you can't miss out and you're mad that you did you know, uh, Yankee Dabbler, believe it or not, is trying to get into the social media aspect. We actually have a TikTok account, and we also are on Facebook. And a lot of times we post the new stuff that we have on Facebook. Matter of fact, if I just scroll here and check this out, let's see, Yankee Dabbler uh, just got typed in. Uh, zombies, 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 my husband was eaten. Zombies, zombies, watch out, take shelter. Is this not zombies? zombies. You think you should be concerned? What? It's like a lot of zombie on it. No, I'm talking about Yankee Dabbler. If I find their 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 page here, I could show you that what we're talking about. Uh, zombies, zombies. Uh, let's see. Uh, vote for me. Yeah, okay, whatever. Zombie. Oh, here you go. All right, so if you take a look here, Yankee Dabbler, you can see that I have here the new box cars I just talked about here. I got the hoppers that I was talking about there. I mean, it's really cool. So if you're not already um, a fan of ours on Facebook, give us a like so that way you can get caught up on everything that we have happening. You know, we have some new engines at Engineer Hall. Are you excited? I uh, know I'm a diesel man. Oh, well, we got some diesel for you. We got some S. D seventy M's. See what I did there? There you go. Yeah. All right, so check out these puppies here. We're gonna start with the demonstrator version here, of course, for the Letcher Motive Division. Take a look at that seventy twenty four. I'm sure there's some significance to that number. What we have here is the Union Pacific. I have here the Ontario Northland for our fans up in Canada. I have here the Lake State Railway. That's kind of an obscure railroad. Don't see too many of that. And then another obscure railway is the CSX, right? Very obscure. Yeah, Very. Not, not many people know about that one. No. But these are really cool looking diesel locomotives here. You know, uh, after they actually came out with a whole bunch of different diesel locomotives, and we're going to be showcasing them over the next several shows here. Well, let's take a look at this Union Pacific that I have here. Nice detailing happening there. I love all, like, take a look at all the warning labels and everything that is going on here with this engine. It looks great. I just love that a lot of manufacturers like Athen are doing that. I really like the design happening here. Well, check this out. I got, look at the windshield wipers. You can run this thing in the in the rain. Absolutely. I don't recommend it, but you could. All right, so these are really great engines here. So, Engineer Hall, which one would you like to run to see what it sounds like? Don't worry, I'll listen to you. I won't just make my pick. Um, the Oscar one? The obscure one? Yeah. All right, so let's run the CSX one. That's the obscure one, right? No, the other one. All right, sounds good. Union Pacific it is. All right, let's get her started. Here is the bell. The horn. Let's get her started.
High ball. That is a really neat sounding diesel locomotive there. It looks great. It runs good. Y'all need good runners, right? Nice, dependable ones. Well, this one retails for $329.99, but we're selling here at Yankee Dabbler for $259.99. So it's a great deal to get on that engine. You get a couple different road numbers there. Match them up. I think it'll look good. Engineer Hall, which one are you going to get? You know what? I already got two already. You got two? Yeah. So you know what that means. What do it mean? You need two more. Oh, you know, you're absolutely right. That's right. And then after that, what do you get? Two more. All right. And then after that? Uh, two more. Yeah. And then after that? Two more after that. Yeah. And then it's a divorce. I know. Uh, don't, yeah. Don't talk but, about. you know, hey, you got engines. All right. So come to Yankee Dow and get those engines and start the madness. So hold on. So, so if I get a divorce, right, so she take half, so I'm buying one for me, one for her in the future, like a long-term investment? Possibly. Yeah, we've had so many great things. In what was that? Uh, probably a bird or something. Not to worry about. Dude, I'm a little concerned about this, man. The glass no, is breaking. You, you hear little what? explosions in the background. You know what? You know, lights just flicker not too long ago, Dave. Come you on, You know man. what? Don't worry about it because we got something to get your mind off of all that whatever is happening. Because we have a steam engine we're going to look at it, Engineer Hall. Okay. I, I, I can take mine with that yeah, for a little bit. Very you know? We have a 482 mount that we're going to take a look at here. Check out these engines here once again. From after, and this is again the Genesis series here, and these are all Southern Pacific locomotives. So if you are a Southern Pacific fan or want a steam locomotive, there you go. I have a couple of different variations here. I love the color on this one, especially the white walls that I have. And then here I have these designs right now. I got a couple of engines here that actually had the Skyline casing here at Southern Pacific, and I have the traditional black one, and then I have here the daylight colors, which I love that scheme. I think it's been called the most beautiful steam engine that's ever been created. Now, take a look at the different variations that I have over here. For example, if I look at these steam engines over here, of course, I have the all black one and I have the color version here. Take a look at this color one, for example, here. So, Engineer Hall, look, I got nice white wall detailing here. I got polished cylinders right there. Even the rest for the arm, the armrest for the engineer is painted. This looks really yeah, good. That, that's because the ah, I'm sorry, the conductor side, or in this case, the fireman. Ooh. But if you take a look at the Skyline engines here, I love the relocation of the bell right here up front. That looks fantastic here. And of course, I mean, come on, Engineer Hall. Does that daylight colors not like fill you with excitement? This daylight color here? This is awesome. I mean, I mean super, it is super on. bright. Now look at these Vanderbilt tenders. These are just so good. I love these engines here. These are great. You know how I am about my steam engines, Engineer Hall. I'm not shy about saying it. So these are really great looking steam engines here. And I think this daylight version is going to be going for a test ride. It's all aboard. So I'll show you a couple of features of this engine starting up. So check it out over here. I'm going to turn it on here. Okay, so let's get the sounds activated. So get the idle sound here. I'm gonna turn on the classification lights right here, and then listen to the dynamo when I turn the headlight on. That was really cool. Let's take a listen to the bell. The whistle. Ooh. I dig it, EH, don't you? Sounds sexy. Let's go.
So, this has a very robust chug if I give it a lot of power. Check this out. I'm going to floor it in the opposite direction. You hear all the different types of chugs that are happening here. So there's a lot of great sound effects here. I love the steam engine. So don't get me wrong. I love our diesels. I know EH. You love your diesels. I love my diesel. But to me, steam engine, you can see the gears move. You hear all the different types of sounds. There's nothing beats in my opinion. Now, the retail value, remember, this is a steam engine. So the retail value of this engine is $599.99. But we're selling here at Yankee Dabbler for $469.99. We don't have a ton of them, but we have a, a few of them left here. I love the designs of these locomotives here. And if you need a steam engine on your roster, if you're looking, if you're a uh, Southern Pacific fan, Fan or whatever the case is, maybe you just love railroad history, or maybe even want something that looks good on the wall. Come check these engines out here. They look good, they sound good, and they're gonna pull a lot of cars, and they're gonna make you very happy on your railroad. We're not gonna talk about your ties today. Well, we do have the steam engine tie because steam is king. Let's face it. Come on, we all know it. Say it with me, engineer hall. No. No, you're no fun. So let's do a recap of all the things that we saw on today's show here. It was the All Atherin Show. Can you put a banner up here that says All Atherin? All right, so if you did it, you would have saw something really cool. I and mean, if you didn't, this is going to look silly. So it's on you. All right, so let's take a look at all the things that we have here. So first of all, we had these mountain type of steam engines here. I really enjoy these engines here. I think I'm going to take uh, all four of them home. I have here the SD70Ms. And these are great pulling diesel locomotives. They look good. They sound good. I don't know what you're waiting for. We had here a whole bunch of Athen Genesis, including these air slide hopper cars here. We had these uh, auto box cars here. We had these uh, coal hopper cars here. I mean, what's not the like, Engineer Hall? There's just so much stuff here. Uh, uh, also, if you don't see none here, oh, check in YankeeDabba.com. That's right. You can go on our website, YankeeDabba.com, type in the search bar what you're looking for. And hopefully, if we have it, we can get it sent to you so you can have just days and uh, really a lifetime of railroading fun. Doesn't that sound good, Engineer Hall? But the initial open up the box. Uh, oh, my gosh. It's like oh that gosh. new train smell. It is perfect. If you're not already subscribed to Engineer Hall's channel, make sure you click that subscribe button to get caught up on all the things that we have on our show here. As a matter of fact, Engineer Hall told me that this year, He's going to be giving out trains trick-or-treating. So anyone that comes to this house, he's just giving out boxcars and hopper cars. It's great. And uh, you want me to include your address here? Sure. All right. It's... Uh all right, so I hope you got that. I hope that the video did. Please show. Well, I would but, love to see it right there. That's right. All right, so hopefully the video went through with that, all right? So uh, we're going to conclude with our rail fan video. We are going to go. Where do you want to go, Engineer? How, what do you want? Do you want steam or you want diesel? What do you want? Um, let's go steam today. All right, well, let's go steam here. And you know what? We're going to go to Western Maryland. Why don't we take a look at it, the 2662 uh, in action, number 1309. It's a really cool-looking steam locomotive. I saw a couple years ago, so I hope you enjoy a rail fan video. Well, I guess now it's uh, time to kind of face whatever's happening out there. I guess it's my turn to see what's happening in the world out there. Uh, I'm a little worried. Oh, God. Uh, brains. Brains? Oh, my brains. Um, brains. Hey, wait, wait. Hey, come on. Hey, you should call somebody. Trace. Trace. No. Trace. Wait, 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 wait a minute. Wait a minute. Th those are our trains. Um. Uh, um, I don't know about this. Um, I'm gonna go take she, care of that. No, no, she get the spray. She's spraying down, disinfect them. Hey, wait a minute. They just took trains, right? Yeah. Trains. 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 